I, I have got to get a haircut. Hello, welcome to Break Niche. This is David, your editor-in-chief. And I would like to talk to you about some things that just happened behind the scenes. Why we haven't really been producing videos in quite a long while, and... And... While we just might be going on this downward spiral or something. <laughs> Although I don't think we really are. We're kind of just throwing stuff at the wall and seeing, seeing what sticks. And I guess some things did stick, I would have to say. But nothing like, nothing that generated crazy views or anything. But we're working on it. We're working on it. It's just one of those things, you know. I've often heard it is harder and harder for smaller creators to do anything off of YouTube these days. I mean, especially get paid from YouTube. Because the reality of it is, they're not exactly generating revenue off of us, the creators, the smaller ones. In fact, they need more viewers than, than anything, really. I guess that's just how it is, and one thing you got to do now is roll with it. I mean, there may be alternatives in the future, but... Well... There have been. But so far, I need to see it to believe it. But, anyway. Speaking of business decisions... Well, one of the main reasons why we've been, I haven't been posted is because I've been working so hard. I've been working really hard. Well, from first this delivery job I've had for most of the year to this new job that I've got, and well, this one is a little bit more labor intensive and is more full time than anything else. Kind of like the Goodwill job, but maybe a little less stressful. I mean, I, I at least I get like three days off, so I'm able to, I guess, to do whatever I wanted, like go to class or. Whatever. But even then, though, there's just not a whole lot of time to make videos anyways. Like, for me, making videos is something I actually need to set up for. I mean, one time I tried to do a walk around ramble and the battery ran out of my, on my camera, so I had to charge that thing. And just, and just today, I moved this thing around about 30 times so, before I could get a good angle. Yeah, it's, it's pretty hard. It's pretty tough. I honestly, I wouldn't say it, it's hard as much as it is time consuming and tedious. You have to sit there and you edit, edit everything out, all the pauses and stuff. And then I don't feel like I have enough time for that. I'm doing so much. I'm... I need to go to the bathroom, I want to make art, I need to eat food, I need to sleep, and all that stuff. I can't be making videos, like, all day, every day. I need to, I need to set a time for that, and to be frank, there's not much in the way of time. There's stuff I am doing. The PC build that I have is done, it just, I just need to transfer data and it'll be finished. I'll show the video. I'll finally get that thing on, but until until I can get all my data from my old computer right here, you probably can't see it, and get it onto the uh, get onto this new PC that I have. I'm just trying to find a good time to get that stuff off the ground, and just haven't been able because I've been working. Not only working it just to get money or buy stuff for myself, but to just eventually get out of this house. I wish it were easier than this. I wish it was a lot easier than this. I wish I could actually get out of here, but I feel like I can't. I feel like I'm stuck here. And... I'm just stuck. I'm stuck overall. I'm trapped. I just feel that way. Maybe this is just a transition. I, I suppose. It's like... As for that job I have, as the jobs I've had before, I actually worked 
too hard for that food delivery job. And that made me the more than a little bit upset with some people and uh, I ended up being let go and thank goodness I was able to get find a new job through the Georgia Department of Transportation. That's just where I'm at right now. And I actually kind of like the work. I really like doing stuff with my hands. I I really really don't like sitting around. So yeah, that job was I guess it's a pretty decent fit so far. But at the same time, though, eventually I might take up a welding job as I said I was going to do a couple of years ago. So who knows what that will entail? Like I said before. I've been busy with a lot of shit, and I learned some things that I'll probably might end up covering in another video, but for now, I'll probably tell you why I worked as hard as I did on that, on that other job, but not right now. It'll have to be later. It is a very sordid, sordid story. One that's, one that's really hurt me ever since, ever since it happened, and it's been, it's been a year since it had happened, so I can't really bring myself to talk about it right now, but like I said, it will be in another video. Until then, Doomsbane will be coming out, and maybe... Maybe we'll play some Doom. <laughs> Take care, y'all.